Hello everybody, my name is Brett from HB Studios and today I'm going to teach you the basics of spin torque and flip torque. Preloading your torque is the main component in performing spin tricks and flip tricks. You can preload, spin torque, flip torque, and pop. First up, let's get you dizzy. Let's talk spinning. By holding one of the triggers, you can see that your rider starts to twist. That's because he or she wants to spin. Left trigger will spin you left right trigger will spin you right but the question is how much will he or she spin for the purpose of this video i'm going to add a little gauge there that coincides with your character animation to show you how to gauge all of your torque so you see if you load torque for a small amount of time you spin slower hold it for a longer amount of time you spin faster however there is a maximum threshold and after you hit that without letting go your spin will decay tremendously and you can see it in your rider's body animation one more time and look at the character animation. That means timing is everything. Now if I remove this graphic, you can see that your character's body animation is the gauge. Pretty soon torque timing will come natural. You will get a feel for what's too little, too much, and just the right amount of preloaded torque. Now let's see how we preload flip torque. You can charge flip torque with the right stick. Just like spins, you need to preload your flip torque before jumping. Hold the right stick in any direction you want to flip relative to your board. Holding up flips over the nose, down over the tail, left over the heel, and right over your toe edge. The main difference from spinning and flipping is that for flipping, you also need to charge some pop by pushing both of the triggers at the same time as holding the right stick. This is how you can perform team dogs, wildcats, and barrel rolls. But learning how to flip is half the battle. Timing your controls and controlling your body in the air is the other half. I will help explain that in the next video. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you learned something because that's exactly what I'm here for. And be sure to check out all the other tutorial videos. I will see you on the mountains.